Hi everyone, we're here at Ross, so let's go shopping. That sign is 20. This one is 20. This check one is 15. We have this sign, Grab Life by the Broom for eight. This garland is six. This wreath is 20 here at Ross. This ghosty pillow for 10. It's a little dirty, so I don't know. Most of these candle holders are seven. These coasters are four of them. There's four of them. This little trinket tray is three. This doorknob is ten. This little gnome is ten. This pumpkin is nine. This little arrangement. This little butter dish. I think I want it. It is six dollars. I'm gonna put it in the cart. These pumpkins are nine. Listen, this is 13, it's a little bit bigger. This wood sign is eight. This set of four coffee mugs is nine dollars. Trick or treat. Happy Halloween. The witching hour is near and creatures of the night. These dishes I say eat, drink, be scary are twelve dollars. This little Tea cups are seven. Pick your poison is five. Oh, that is so cute. Look at that. This little dish is seven. That's seven. Skull cups with lids and straws is seven. It's, it's like a witch's brew. And poison apple, 13. I might get it for the whole witch area that I have. For my Disney lovers, Jack Skellington. These coasters are seven. This is six. Wow, that's big. This Frankenstein is nine. And look, it has a topper. This garland is 11. String lights. Little bottles are 13. Let's see if it works. Ooh, look. Five dollars, seven, the yeah, other muertos, six, this little, look how cute, eleven, a set of six bowls for five dollars, look at that, the little puppies, and cats, it's just a just focus, focus, for six, a little broom, this one is ten, Oh, look at this. 
looks like a little creamer set. I'm looking for a little cream. Let's, let's get the party started. If you're enjoying this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. So here we have these accent rugs for five. We have the other one, Muertos, Harvest Blessing, a skull one. Just like a little, these are like cheapy, but I don't, I kind of like these because I end up, if my rugs get too, too dirty, I just end up throwing them away. Hi everyone. So I wanted to come on and show you my Ross haul. This wasn't much, um, but I think a lot of the items you did see in my video, my Ross, it's like a hit or miss. And for the most part, it's a big miss. Um, there's like barely any seasonal decor. And if there is, I'm either missing it or people are just buying it as soon as it hits the floor, which is, it could be. Um, but I did pick up a couple of the items. So the first thing that I picked up was this butter dish for $5.99. I thought it was so pretty and I liked like the whole glam here. It's like a whole spider web and spiders. I thought this was really beautiful for the price. So I definitely picked that up. The next thing that I picked up were these Happy Harvest Mickey uh, for $5.99. These oven mitts comes with two. So I thought that was really nice. I like to change my oven mitts uh, seasonally. The next thing that I bought was $5.99 as well were these two wooded um, spoon and slotted turner with like a pink finish. I know it kind of doesn't go with my color scheme, but I needed a new, I wanted to throw away some of the, like the plastic that I had. Um, and I wanted to kind of get these like a little, a little better quality. So I bought those. The next thing that I bought was this Anastasia uh, $4.99. It's a So Hollywood Loose Highlighter and I kind of wanted to try it. Um, I'll have to let you guys know. I'll have to kind of open it and let you know, kind of put it on. So for makeup for me, I normally don't wear any makeup throughout the week. And if I do put on makeup, it's mostly for like if I go on a date or on the weekends with my like with my boyfriend and my son or if it's just my boyfriend and I so that's where I'll put a little bit of makeup and to be honest like my makeup consists of just putting like putting on my eyebrows mascara blush highlighter and something on my lips I don't put foundation on just because a I don't think I could ever find my true color and because I have freckles like on my cheeks I don't like to hide that I like to kind of embrace that I think that's probably like one of the things that I like most about my face or my freckles and um, so I don't wear that I don't wear foundation um, so if you're interested I could always do a video of kind of like a get ready with me it t literally takes me five minutes to do to put on my face I guess you can say um, so I do, anytime that I can kind of find like a nice highlighter I always like to see just because that is something that I kind of do put on like a little bit of glitter on my face I always like to do that and the next thing that I bought was this like little organizer and the reason why I bought it was to hopefully be able to fit um, the little like press on nails that I've been getting and they do fit so I've been able to put like a whole set in one little compartment and I figured this will help me kind of know what I have and that hopefully I can start putting more like my boyfriend loves when I put on nails um so and i do too it's just i don't i just can't see myself paying 30 40 you know dollars to go put on nails when my job is so physically demanding that i'm just like afraid a to mess them up b to break a nail during a mission so I, that's why i normally don't go to a salon now don't get me wrong i get a pedicure you know every three weeks but just for a manicure, you know, being in the military, colors are a big thing, like what you can and cannot wear. And then to put like acrylics, it's just a whole big ordeal. 
So I thought this would be a great way to organize uh, those nails that I've been getting. So I have the color that I wore this weekend. I have this like navy blue with like a gold accent and they're kind of just like twist ons. This was $4.99. And then I have like this red press on as well. So I thought that would look cute during like the winter holidays. So I have to add my Halloween collection. So I haven't decided how I want to organize it. Maybe I'll organize it maybe through like seasonal or just put like maybe liked colors alike. So I think until I get, right now I only have four different colors, but maybe if I ever find more, definitely maybe organize them a different way and they all fit. So it's all like about the top. Now I have seen that name brand at Walmart and they are more expensive at Walmart. So at Home Goods or TJ Maxx, I pay $4.99 for the set and at Walmart they want $7.97, I believe. So even though Walmart does have more styles and more colors, I'm fine getting them at Home Goods or TJ Maxx. I don't think I want to spend the extra couple of dollars. Maybe I will, who knows? But for right now, I'm fine with just getting them at Home Goods. So that is all that I got. Ooh, no. And I got the ghost pillow. So I got him. They gave me 10% off. So they took off a dollar. So he ended up being nine. I tried cleaning him a little, just like some of the spots that he had. It looked like he probably fell on the floor and instead of someone picking that, picking him up, they probably either like kicked him or, you know, just left them on the floor. So he was just more like dusty and dirty in that sense. But I tried spot cleaning him to try to take some of the things off, but he was $9 and I'm so happy that I found him. He's just on my couch. So that is everything from Ross, small, how I said, it's a hit or miss when it comes to my Ross. Um, but yeah, definitely don't forget to like and subscribe. The quicker we get to a thousand subscribers, the quicker I can give away that Halloween gingerbread house. So thank you for watching. Bye.